Hello, my beautiful Taurus. Welcome to June readings. General energy loves who is coming towards you. What's on the way towards you this month? Could be a person, could be a situation, could be a energy. Also, keep in mind this is a general energy, general messages. My resonate, my do not as much. So let's see, darlings. Of course, if there is certain things we need to look into deeper, we'll look as well. Let's see. Taurus, who's coming? What's on the way to you? I have a seven of cups underneath. Page of cups. Strength. Six of pentacles and nine of cups. What I'm hearing, there is an energy here that speaks about be patient. Things will evolve naturally or let the things evolve naturally. For some of you, you might deal here with a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces, or a Leo. There is a wish here that will be fulfilled if you will let the things flow and go naturally. Okay, there's something here also about balance. Bring balance. All right, let's see. Two of Wands. Eight of Swords. Queen of Wands. Four of Cups, Five of Wands. Okay, so the only major arcana here for you, we have the Strength. Some of you might have Leo in the chart, or it could be a Leo here, very significant. But also the Strength speaks of, you got this. You can handle this. No matter whatever the situation, no matter how the things are, no matter how the things can go through, because definitely here certain things might, might not be necessary that you can control or fix or do. It's kind of like you, you got this, you have this. Somebody here, it's kind of like life is a mystery you as you go as you will find everything forward you don't need to take it all or you don't need to know it all yes this month might be um, fulfilled with certain uh, certain things but spirit says don't let certain uh, things or even certain people to tell you certain things or tell you what to do or how to do the things like you know better okay for some of you you might have some kind of surprise coming in with this tower okay if you are dealing here with someone and you don't know what's going on or who are they for you what they want from you I feel here someone might my found the one it's like a um, situation here is kind of resolving by itself. Don't let others to, to get in between your own business. Let them mind their business. You mind your business. There's something at that line. Let's see. What's the two of wands? Two of cups. Nine of pentacles. And the Empress, there is kind of a, a energy here that speaks that you are gonna get more if you are gonna keep things for you. And most importantly, be confident that what you have is what you need. It sounds a mis mysterious energy here, but Spirit says you are gonna have more if you are going to keep it private, there's something here you got to keep private. Certain things you got to keep private for you. 
for example, for some of you, if you are dealing with someone for quite a while, things could get, you know, serious till the things are not legit or clear. Keep the relationship for you. Or there's something here that you don't need to tell others or certain things unless you are sure. Was the five of wands? Yeah, because things might might slip out of the of the roof. Okay. For some of you, there is a um, a financial opportunity that is meant for growth. And Spirit says, unless you seal the deal don't tell anyone yes because to the next opportunity you will gonna wait a long time so certain things here is unless you done it keep it for you yeah many many um, Taurus people will have new love new energies and if you if you got recently broke up with someone or if you recently, you know, let somebody behind. I don't feel here you expected to have this new energies or new opportunities. Yes, because for some of you, you might have a choice between the new love and the, and someone from your past. Okay. Four of Pentacles, yes, Hierophant, Nine of Wands, and Ace of Swords, Page of Swords. Somebody here is keeping an eye on you, darlings. Somebody here is keeping an eye on you. the Queen of Wands, Nine of Swords, Moon, Eight of Cups. Somebody here also who is watching you, they will finally move on. If there, if you are dealing here with someone who always want to be around you, coming back and things like that, if you are going to choose to move forward with someone new, they they will see it and they will stop communicating or they will stop coming back over and over and over there's definitely here a person who will want to be back to you but if you're going to choose a different uh, path they will redirect their energy towards someone else absolutely absolutely what else for my Taurus? You definitely have an offer here. An offer for the long term. So it could be love or it could be other side. It could be work. What advice we have for all of this? I, I also feel here for some of you, you are going to be, make better decisions. Or this month, it's a good time to make good decisions. So you are going to make them one step at a time. Absolutely. Again, don't let others to get into your business or into your life. Because that will cost you big time spirit says stand up for yourself that's when you are gonna have a winning card or that's when you are gonna get what's right for you and then you realize that it's impossible to be friends with everyone it's impossible to make everyone happy but it's not impossible for you to be happy. 
So my Taurus feels here that this month could look quite hectic, but definitely quite productive. For some of you, indeed, you are going to make certain choices to move forward. And I definitely see here great opportunity coming in. For those of you who were dating or not with someone or you didn't know if this person, I can date them or I can be with them. You, you might find yourself with that person in a relationship or you might um, be official together. Because I feel here there's a lot of clarity coming in for many, many of you. I also see here there is long-term single Tauruses or there is a single Taurus here who've been long time single. And doesn't feel here you are going to be single for too long. Absolutely. For some of you, you will be surprised when someone might um, confess their feelings for you or that they want something more with you. For some of you, might feel like a, a month of full of surprises. Like it's kind of, you know, sometimes the universe um, does a clean up. Certain people will go away and you surprisingly are going to be happy that they are going away. And for others, there are certain people will come to you and will want to continue life with you. It's kind of like everything, it settles the way it's supposed to. And I'm hearing it's coming towards you the calmer waters, those energies that you always wanted to have. Sometimes I don't feel here you will, you will um, consider yourself that you are blessed or not. But Spirit says, don't, don't keep yourself small. Appreciate these moments because these moments are to be cherished. So lovely Taurus, that's what's on the way towards you this month of June. Love and light loves. And yeah, enjoy these moments, darlings. Blessings. But before we go, know that some of you, you passed a test. Whatever the test was, you passed the test. And you move to the next level. See ya, my darlings. Blessings. Bye for now.